What's up, you guys? Welcome. <laughs> yes. What's up, you guys? Welcome back. We're gonna be heading over to Lowe's later on today or tomorrow. We're gonna be picking up some wood to make some trellises for my dear garden. And my husband will be doing this project for me. <laughs> they sell a bunch of trellises over at Lowe's and Home Depot and stuff, but the quality is mm, not it. No, it's not the same. Yeah, it's very we, wonky. <laughs> and as always, we can make it better. Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> we should make that like our logo or something. Like sure. our theme song. Oh my god, our theme song. We need a theme song. We're going to show you exactly what you need to purchase and what you need to get to do this project. So, let's go. All right, so we just got out of Lowe's. We ended up buying around 12 of the one by two by eights. Those are the pressure treated ones since they will be going outside. And since we're at Lowe's, we have to make a coffee run. So let's do that first and then we're gonna head on home. All right, so we just got back from Lowe's and what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be cutting everything to size. It has a six feet high by two feet wide is each trellis and we're gonna be building two of them. And what we did was we bought the wood and I bought the nails and we're gonna measure first, we're gonna cut, and then we're gonna put it together. So I'm gonna be showing you what I bought. All right, so before we get started, my wife's gonna go ahead and show you guys where she's gonna be installing these trellises. They're actually big enough already to start hanging them just so they don't start tilting over like that. So the plan was to do it from around here to the edge enough to get this one and have enough space to grow out. You ready for your support, little buddy? Make sure to like and subscribe below. Let's get started. So for this project, we purchased the one by two by eights at Lowe's. They run for about $2 a piece. And for each trellis, you're gonna need three vertical pieces that measure six feet and eight horizontal pieces that measures two feet. As always, make sure you measure twice so you only have to cut once. Hours later. Okay, so as the helper, without much experience, I love this, okay? This came in a kit we bought in Ikea for some furniture and it's a lifesaver because if I were to hold this, I would have smashed all of my fingers. So the way it works is you put it between here and it holds it for you, okay? So let me give you an example. Pretend this is the wood, you hold it like this and then you hammer it and your fingers are out of the way. So I have no idea what it's called. I guess I'll, I'll look for it online and try to link something similar below, but lifesaver, okay? So let's get to building. All right, so with all the woods cut, it's time to start building. What you wanna do is set the top and the bottom horizontal woods at about two inches from the edges and then all the other ones are gonna go about eight inches apart. And in this part is where you have to be the most careful. Make sure you don't hammer that finger. Super sturdy. <laughs> and just like that, we have our first trellis. <sighs> so how much do these go for? So they average, not this one, the ones that are usually a bit thinner, they average for about $15. Okay. each and the wood for this one came out to about eight bucks okay so more affordable definitely sturdier like like <laughs> i mean this is not going anywhere okay hurricane season we bought in the ones from the store yes they're painted you're gonna save some time but if you want quality 
I would say make it yourself. You could do this in less than an hour, 30 minutes, so. And we actually bought these screws. It's actually the first time we use them. They are the underlayment nails. They run for about $5. And the good thing about these is if you notice, they, let me see if I can focus. All right, you see those little grooves right there? That's to make sure that that wood is not going anywhere. So um, just like everything else that we've been using, you'll find the link in the description below. Um, but definitely first time using them and I love them. So, and, and let's talk about my amazing <laughs> little hammer. <laughs> this is from Harbor Freights. We're gonna go ahead and install these in the garden and then we're all done. I hope you like this video. As always, like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And we'll see you next time on Handy Creators. Bye.